Hey guys, Dustin here, or Kelleborn Dark Flame. Um, so, <laughs> I'm sure that y'all are getting tired of me doing haul videos, but I have a couple things that I wanted to show off, and let's see. These are going to be some of my prized possessions. Um, first couple of things that I got. Uh, I know anybody that's watched Ember, she just talked about me being a bad influence on her. Well, she's a bad influence on me too. Because I bought some pens and some ink, which I got the same ink that she did because she said it was good. So, But these are the pens that I got. They're fountain pens. Let's see if you can if it'll focus on. Okay. Anyway, um, so I got two of them. They came from China. So there's some like off brand name. They're not like her hundred dollar whatever pins, but I think I paid like five bucks each for them or something like that. So I'm going to use those in my grimoire to write my stuff. And I've been wearing a hat all day, so my hair looks... It actually doesn't look bad, but... But yeah, so those that, that's that. Um, the other thing that I got, actually things that I got, um, I know if any of you have watched my, <laughs> my TJ Maxx videos, uh, I've been looking for amethyst crystals. Um, and because you, I mean, usually you can't find any that are less than good quality or pretty ones or nice large ones for less than a hundred bucks, um, depending on where you go. Because I found some small ones um, at Romancing the Stone that were like forty dollars, and I'm just like, you know, that's tiny compared to what I could get. Um, or what I really wanted, I guess I should say, not really what I could get, but, um, so this is the first one. What I did is I went on eBay, <laughs> me and eBay have a love-hate relationship, um, I tried winning a few and I didn't get them, get them, so I was like, okay, well crap, so I tried like for four of them, so then there were a couple more that I liked that came up, and, uh, sorry, I've been at work today, and I've got dry contacts. Anyway, uh, sorry, I paused you while I was yawning, because <laughs> I don't need to have the half the world yawning. Well, not really half the world, but whatever. Um, so I went on, and I... <laughs> decided to bid on two different ones um, and I put a maximum bid of like 50 bucks I'm thinking okay whatever I'm not gonna win because the other ones I lost by like a dollar like one was fifty one dollars and then another one was fifty six dollars and I bid like fifty five and fifty so I was like whatever I'm probably not gonna win them so so be it <laughs> Needless to say, I won both of them, um, which I'm not completely upset about, uh, because when you see these, you'll see why I was okay with it, <laughs> even though it was, and I got impatient and had them ship one because I didn't know that I was going to win the other one, and I got charged shipping twice, but that's another story. Um, so this is the first one that I won, and it is just fucking gorgeous. And they're all cut at the bottom so that they can stand. And so this one, I mean, if you look at it, I mean, I, I think I got it with shipping for $46. Um, I could easily probably sell this on eBay 
for like $125 just for the simple fact of the size. I believe this one was three pounds, maybe three, no, this one was three, almost, I think it was three and a half pounds, but look at it, it's very deep, beautiful colors. Sorry, I'm watching it on. This is shiny object syndrome is what this is. Um, <clears throat> so that's the first one that I won. And so then, <laughs> five hours later, or 20 hours later, or whatever what it was, um, this is the other one that I had bid on. And it's this one. And looking at it this direction, it's not such a... I mean, it's, it's beautiful, yes, but for us witchy folks, if you turn it to the side, it's in the shape of a crescent moon. And then on the back, that looks, there was more crystals that started to form in the back of it. So not only do I have it on the front here, but it's also back here on this side and this is just an absolutely gorgeous piece um, <clears throat> excuse me yeah I don't know that I could ask for a better sign than this beautiful crescent moon shape so <clears throat> That was that. I try to get them to help me with the shipping a little bit since I ordered two and they really were like, well, next time. <laughs> like, yeah, next time. I, it took me a week to win those two, so. And somebody, hang on. Yeah, I have an order pop-up, sorry. Um, they did go ahead and send me a couple of extras, and they're gorgeous um, as far as crystals go. They're, they're just quartz crystals, nothing spectacularly fancy about them. Um, but they are, I can go in and... Uh, this is one. Um, it's actually fairly clear. Um, I could take and wrap this one. Uh, this is a... Looks like there's a few of them here. There's one that's here and one down here. It's, uh, I believe, what they consider, per my crystal book that I got, a cathedral quartz, um, which is just where, I mean, it has multiple points that have started on it, and it looks like a cathedral, a church, yeah, where they have different shapes and whatnot. Anyway, so these were my extras. I mean, if I were to go down to the witchy shop, I'd probably pay five bucks for them. So I'm not going to complain. Um, I'm definitely not going to complain about the price that I paid, um, even with the shipping, because like I said, those, if I was to buy from Romancing the Stone, Romancing, yeah, Romancing the Stone, um, I would have paid that much for one that was a quarter of that size, so totally not going to bitch about it. But anyway, that's my small little haul video. Um, I just thought I would share. I think this is probably one of my shortest videos other than the one about my ring, which the other video that I did, I didn't even talk in it. I really just <laughs> put it on because I... Uh, wanted to show it off but uh it's a labradite ring 
And this is what it looks like. It's actually a really pretty ring. Um, it's <laughs> the same place that I got a uh, uh, Ember's earrings and her pendant at. And uh, where is anyway? So yeah, um, it's in sterling silver, and it's actually a fairly large ring. I mean, I have fat fingers anyway, but, and it's uh, sterling silver, and it's, I work in a post office, and so sweating all day, it kind of tarnishes it. Um, I don't mind it, it makes it look older, frankly, um, so it's whatever but it's a pretty ring so yeah so uh first of all i want to thank everybody that's subscribing to my channel from ember um love her to death and uh yeah hopefully soon me and her will do a hangout sometime and uh video it and <laughs> All that fun jazz. We're actually making some plans on meeting up somewhere uh, in the near future. So, anyway, um, I'm going to do a couple, probably a couple videos on herbs. So, be on the lookout for those. They shall be coming shortly um, because I'm trying to do a video, maybe two videos today. And I need to make some more products, so I'm going to have some more product videos on my other channel. So yeah, anyway, um, again, thank you for all of you that, oh, here's my other ring. I guess I could show that one. I've had this one for a while. It's a uh, turquoise, and it's an antique. I got it off eBay, of course. Um, but I just liked it. This one's tarnished the same way too. You see it on the side there. Um, so again, thank you for subscribing. If you uh, like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you uh, would share the video, because I'm gonna do a little giveaway whenever I get up to uh, 500 subscribers, which at this rate it's going up pretty fast now because of Ember, but, uh, so yeah, I'm gonna leave my hair. um, so yeah, so be on the lookout for more videos, um, on herbs. Last night I did a video on wormwood, so today we'll probably do the video because I actually talked about wormwood and mugwort yesterday, so here's the mugwort, so I probably will do that next. But anyway, um, many blessings to you all, and I hope to see you on the next video, or at least see your number come up. <laughs> so, uh, blessed be. Have a great night and weekend.